now we can multiply two matrices only if they are conformable for multiplication so just like addition uh, we can add two matrices but then only when they are addition uh, conformable so in the case of addition the conformability is about uh, when they are of same sizes we can add two matrices only when they are of same sizes right but here when we have two matrices a and b we can multiply two matrices a and b only when they are conformable for multiplication and it is a bit different from uh, addition so what does it uh, mean is here if the number of columns in a is equal to number of rows in b then only we can multiply them otherwise multiplication is not possible right so addition and multiplication is cannot be possible always only when the matrices are conformable for addition and conformable for multiplication in case of addition both the sizes have to be same and in case of multiplication remember this the number of columns in a should be equal to number of rows in b then only we can multiply them right for example here if the uh, order of a is m by n and if the order of b is n by p right here number of columns in a is equal to number of rows in b right which means these two are equal then only we can multiply them otherwise multiplication is not possible let us say the result matrix the resulting matrix is going to be c right then what what will be the order of c is n m by p right so m p m by p got it so the number of rows in the resulting matrix will be equal to number of rows in the a and the number of columns in the resulting matrix will be equal to number of columns in b got it and this multiplication is possible only when number of columns in a is equal to number of rows in b you need to remember that okay and um, i'll do one thing i'll take an example and i'll show you how the multiplication is done you must be knowing about it but just for the sake of revision i am doing it uh, see multiplication is also done by this rule it is also called as uh, row by column rule row by column rule means we take the row from the first matrix and multiply with the corresponding elements of the column from the second matrix right then we get a element in the resulting matrix okay i'll better i'll take an example and explain you what i mean by this let us say a and b are two small i'll take small example 2 by 2 matrices right so a11 a12 a21 a22 it is a 2 by 2 matrix and similarly let me take a 2 by 2 b a b11 b12 b21 b22 now if i multiply this let us say i get a new matrix c right now we have to get the element here right so the element index of this the index of this element is going to be 11 1, isn't it so 11 1, 1 means you have to take first row from a and first column from b and you have to multiply the corresponding elements and then sum them up right so first row from a and first column from b and multiply the corresponding elements and then sum them up now if i multiply the corresponding elements what do i get a11 b11 right plus a12 b21 right a12 b21 got it and now this is the first element it is going to be c11 right and now if i want next element what is the index of this next element it is 1 2 isn't it so what does it mean one first row second column right so take the first row and take the second column and you multiply the corresponding elements and then sum them up now if i multiply the corresponding elements what i get is a11 b12 plus getting this a11 b12 plus a12 b22 right and here the next element is uh, second row first column 2 1 right so take the second row from a and take the first column from b and you multiply them and put them there then what do i get multiply the corresponding elements and then sum them up a21 plus b11 a21 into b11 plus 
ए टू टू बी टू वन राइट एंड नाउ अगेन द सेम थिंग सेकेंड रो एंड इज दिस वन राइट टू 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 मीन्स सेकेंड रो एंड सेकेंड कॉलम दिस वन मल्टीप्लाइड विद दिस देन वॉट डू वी गेट ए टू वन बी वन टू प्लस ए टू टू बी टू टू राइट सो दिस इज हाउ वी डू इट दैट इज वेट इज ऑल्सो कॉल्ड एज रो बाई कॉलम मल्टीप्लीकेशन राइट सो वन थिंग यूर रिमेंबर इज वी कैन नॉट मल्टीप्लाई ऑल द मैट्रिस दे हैव टू बी कन्फर्मेबल फॉर मल्टीप्लीकेशन सो वॉट डज इट मीन द नंबर ऑफ रोज इन दिस सो द नंबर ऑफ कॉलम्स इन द फर्स्ट मैट्रिक्स शुड बी इक्वल टू नंबर ऑफ रोज इन द सेकेंड मैट्रिक्स and the resulting matrix will contain uh, the same number of rows as as there are in the first matrix and the same number of columns as they are in the uh, second matrix got it so this is how we do the multiplication now let's say let's see the properties of multiplication okay